welcome to my channel and welcome back if you've been here before this is natasha my today's haul or should i say my day's purchase is as you can see my first ever purchase from this company is hermes or hermes i bought a pair of shoes something i could have actually i've been watching it for a while and i wonder i really wanted these slippers not slippers but sandals i really wanted them I had I didn't even know they existed until I went to the um site last year or was it the year before and um when I seen them I wanted them but I'm the type of person like I will not buy something for a while I have to I have to think about my purchase and I always say to myself if it's still there at the time that um I go to buy it, then it was meant for me to have it. If it's not there, then it was not meant for me to have it. But I was, the price went up on this twice. So, on the second time it went up, I said, I better get it <laughs> before the price goes up um, again. So, that's exactly what I did. So, this is the, I already opened the box because I already did the, um, through the mail. And so, when stuff comes in, I will open it and check it and make sure that everything is okay with it as soon as it comes in. Like, as soon as it comes out of my mailbox or as soon as the um, UPS or FedEx guy drops it off, I will open it immediately. Because I've done it before, like, when I ordered something from my mom, like a statue from my mom. Let's say it came in at 8. By 8.03, I was already emailing the woman showing her um, how the statue was broken in pieces. And she was like, go ahead and just, I'm just going to go ahead and refund your money. Because it was within three minutes. It, it was just that quick. I mean, I didn't let a day go by. I didn't let an hour go by. It was within three minutes. I was like, boom, boom, boom. It's broken. So I do that with everything that I um I buy. I open it, make sure everything is okay. So I can get in touch with them real quick and fast. Because the longer that you wait, the more people tend to think that maybe you broke it. And, um... Now you want them to replace it because you did something wrong with the product and you want them to replace it. So I like to take my stuff out and examine it just as quickly as it came in. So if there's a problem, I'm going to it real quick and fast. So that's what I did here. So um, this is the envelope with the receipt. Now, I don't know how to say the name of these shoes. This is French as long. So I'm gonna fold the envelope again because it has my address on it. Let's see if my um camera can pick this up. Can you guys see that? I don't know if you can see that. Because my camera's getting like a casting off of darkness. Let me see here. Let me mess with my light. There we go. So let's see here. I don't know if you guys can see that. But that right there is the name of the product. Let me see. I don't know how to say it, but it's um sandal and it's in blue. And it's a size 38. Um I bought them I wore a size six and a half, which I've always told everyone I do. Um whenever I buy my chin shoes, I buy a size 30 38. 36.5, uh, that's like 38, I bought 36.5 and tension was 6.5, um, when I buy my regular shoes, I buy a size 7.5 because I like my shoes to be, um, like if my foot swell up, I still like to be able to get in and out my shoes, which is something that my mom taught me and my grandmother taught me and another older woman taught me, and um, when I'm wearing four shoes, I will go up another size if it's sandals. Because um they do one whole size. So if it's a whole size, I will not go from a six and a half to a seven and a half. I would usually do like an eight because this because I have wide feet. So I have short feet, but I have wide feet at the same time. So I would go up another size up. So I'll go from a um six and a half to eight when it's sandals and it's a foreign um shoe. When it's in the whole size. I even do it in American whole size. So all right, so let's dig in a little further. <laughs> His 
the ribbon. Oh my goodness! I'm just so loving this. It's one of the shoe bags. Look at this. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I know I already opened and looked at it, but I didn't look at it for that long. Just looked at it enough to make sure that everything was okay. I haven't even tried them on because I already know they're going to be big on me because I ordered size 8. Because, like I said, I'm 36 and a half. So, <sighs> deep breath, deep breath. I'm so excited. This is like going to church on Halloween. Oh my goodness. Let's see if I can get this out with just one hand. Look at that electrical fine blue. As you can see, I haven't tried it on, like I said. Just enough to make sure that everything was okay, that it wasn't broken, cracked. Oh. Isn't that pretty? Oh my goodness. And right here it says Hermes. Paris, got the horse and carriage. Look at that. Isn't that so pretty? I didn't even know they sold this. I was going for the Iran, Iran sandals. When I happened to be going through the whole side, I was like really bored. I was like, I'm going for the Iran. I wanted it in black or um tan. And I'm just remember saying, okay, that's what I'm set on. And I was just going through the website, bored, <laughs> just a little bored. I went through it, and I saw these, and I said, I want these over the Arons. These were just so much more prettier to me. And so ever since then, like I tell you guys, what I like to do is I like to buy my handbags and my shoes. Then I buy the clothes around it. I buy my outfit around the accessory. So I've been shopping for something to go with this. All so far, all I've been able to come up with is like a little doll dress um, for the summer. I'm trying to find something or a blue jumpsuit. So I'm trying to find something that'll match with this. Because I plan on going to Dallas to visit with my brother. And I want to go to Tiffany's. To buy um, a necklace to match my bracelet that I bought for my last birthday. So, um, I'm trying to find an outfit that'll match the Galleria, the Dallas Galleria. But this is what it looks like. Isn't it pretty? Alright, let's open the next one. <laughs> my first ever. Buying something from them ever, and hopefully, with the grace of God and the blessing of God, it won't be my last. Look at that! That is so pretty. This is the bottom. You don't see. I don't know if you guys can see where it says thirty-eight. But isn't that pretty? Go side by side. This is what it looks like. That is so pretty. Well, anyways, my first ever purchase from Hermes, and hopefully not my last. Well, depends on when you're watching this. You have a good morning. Good afternoon. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning.